my husband had a jerk chicken tortellini at a little restaurant in Maryland and has been begging me to make it. So I kind of came up with my own version and added asparagus and mushrooms. You can buy jerk seasoning at the store, but it's actually pretty easy to make your own. The more you cook, the more of the stuff you'll already have on hand. So just measure them out into a bowl, mix it up until you're ready to use it on your chicken. Once your chicken is cubed up, um, just mix it in a bowl with your spices and cover and refrigerate for at least an hour. Moving right along, gather your other ingredients. Measure out your wine, your whipping cream, your chicken broth, and your butter. Wash your veggies, slice your mushrooms, uh, trim your asparagus and slice it. Go ahead and mince up your parsley and grate your parmesan. Okay, grab your first pot. Go ahead and add the water and salt and turn to high to get the water boiling. Now's a good time to set your oven to 200 or the warm setting. Grab your second pot, add the oil, and once the oil's hot, add your chicken. Um, it's only gonna take about three minutes for your chicken to cook through. Just kind of keep it moving. Some of your spices are gonna come off. Don't freak out. Um, you're actually gonna make the sauce in this same pot, so it, you're, you're gonna be using those spices later. You'll be working in batches, so if you need more oil, just add it. But once all of your chicken is cooked, put it in a bowl and slide it in the oven to stay warm. Once you see your water's boiling, add your asparagus and boil for about three minutes. Then use a slotted spoon to remove it and put it in a bowl and set aside. You might need to add a minute or two if you've got real thick asparagus stalks. Don't forget, don't pour the water out. You're gonna use this same pot to cook your tortellini. Okay, back to your chicken pot. Go ahead and melt the butter. Add the mushrooms. You're gonna stir them around and get them all nice and coated and cook them for about five minutes. Add your garlic, stir, cook for about a minute. Then you'll add your white wine, stir, and cook for three to four minutes. Go ahead and add your broth and your whipping cream. Uh, stir to combine and then just uh, adjust the heat down to like a medium low and let it simmer. Cook your tortellini in your asparagus water per the package instructions, probably seven to nine minutes. And then going back to your sauce, add salt and pepper and your parsley. Stir in your chicken, your asparagus, and your tortellini. Serve it in warm bowls topped with Parmesan. Wow. Washing the dishes? Mm -hmm. I'll show you, but listen to me. What is this big mess you made? Look. Hold on, what is this mess you made? What is that? Mom. I'm confused. How did you do this? That's big. That's big. That's a very big mess. Why did you do that? What do you say? You like I it? I don't understand. Yay. There's so many flavors. My mouth is watering. I love you. Thank you.